The genius of the peekaboo style is how it allows the shorter fighter to enter against a taller opponent. This is through head movement, feints, and defensively making the other guy miss and then coming in with counter shots. Andy Nance and Freddie Roach used to always say out of the classical boxing style, reset your guard. Namely, every few seconds as you're moving your head, as you're moving around the ring, as you're rhythming in and out, you're gonna reset. The beauty of the peekaboo turtle guard is that you can actually fight out of this reset stance and punch out of it, which you're unable to do in the traditional stance. Bas Rutten described it out of Pancrase that with this rear, folder uh, rear shoulder forward, your right hand is constantly loaded up and your left hand is already cocked for a left hook. Whereas in the traditional stance, you have to bring the rear shoulder forward in order to get that power with the lead hook. That's the beauty of the peekaboo style. Now, keep in mind, if you're turned forward out of this bladed profile stance, coach used to say point, point, it would mean point the rear shoulder, namely get more angled. But in MMA and kickboxing, where there's takedowns and kicks, you're gonna have to bring that rear shoulder forward, which brings a lot more access to these power weapons. <laughs>